Hi everyone and welcome to the channel. Today I am participating in a, an open invitation to participate in a challenge. And the title of the challenge is the Upcycle Your Stash Challenge for 2020. And the host of this collaboration are two beautiful ladies right here on YouTube, Mrs. V of the channel Saving with Mrs. V and Robin of the channel All Things Lux by Robin. And these two ladies, V and Robin, are asking us to upcycle our stash um, and create decor using items that we already have because we're on a quarantine um, stay-at-home order. We're not able to go out and, and purchase any home decor right now. So the ladies are asking us to use what we already have in our stash to decorate with, and they want us to upcycle it and uh, you guys how we're going to use it in our home. Um, if you're not familiar with Saving with Mrs. V and All Things Lux by Robin, I will go ahead and put the links to their channels in my description box uh, right down below. Um, guys, you want to go over and check out their channels. Both of these ladies have some great content on their channels. Mrs. V does a little bit of everything, but her focus is to help you save money. And uh, Robin has an awesome channel as well, and she does a lot of home decor, tablescapes, um, so she has a great channel as well. So both of their channels will be linked below as well as the playlist for this challenge. If you click on the link, which I'll provide in my description box, you'll be able to see everyone's video that's taking part in this collaboration. All right, guys, um, as you see here, I've got this white tray. And as you see, guys, I've got this white tray. I've had this tray um, for a while. I've used it in a vignette before. So I decided to go ahead and pull it out. And you saw these two napkins that I had in the tray. What I'm going to attempt to do today is to decoupage this tray um, using one of these napkins. I was sitting here pondering and trying to figure out which one I wanted to use. And initially I thought about using this napkin. Um, but since I have not decoupaged before, this is my first decoupage DIY. I thought that this might be a little bit too much for me to handle, you know, cutting out these, the little circles and things like that. So I thought that maybe this time I would just try with this napkin with the floral print. And since we are in the spring season and getting ready to go into summer here in another month, um, I'm gonna use the floral napkin instead to decoupage my tray and I'm going to be using of course some Mod Podge and I've got my um, brushes here ready to go some water and um, we're going to go ahead and get started if this is your first time to my channel welcome to the channel this is a lifestyle channel and over here we enjoy cooking cleaning home decor shopping hauls and occasionally a DIY so if you enjoy that type of content, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button and tap that notification bell so you'll be notified every time that I upload a new video. And if you're a returning friend to the channel, welcome back. Thank you so much for supporting me and this channel. All right, guys, I do have my supplies here, which consist of Mod Podge, I've got a little bowl of water so that I can wet my fingers so I can peel this napkin. And then I've got my paint brushes. So I'm just taking a little bit of that water and just dipping my finger in it so that hopefully I can get this napkin pulled apart without ripping it. And so that's the first step in this, um, upcycle project is to peel apart the napkin. Um, and I do have some more napkins in case this one doesn't want to act right. Um, but let me go ahead and try to get this peeled apart. It's three layers, so you have to peel apart all three of the layers. So hopefully I can get these pulled apart without doing a lot of damage. All 
right, guys, I got that one pulled off. Now we're gonna move on to peeling these two apart. So I'm gonna dip my fingers in a teeny bit of water. Wish me luck. Okay guys, I've got one napkin pulled apart and I'm pull, pulling apart another napkin, but I managed to pull the print side away from the other two so I don't have to worry about trying to separate this, those other two. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pull this, finish pulling it um, from the other two napkins. All right guys, so now the next step is to try to get this measured out the way it needs to be so that it'll fit inside of the tray. So let me see if I can get this the way I want it. Kind of have it right in the center where the crease is. So this little part here, I need to come off. So what I'm doing guys is wetting this um, paintbrush and then I'm going to run it along the napkin to separate it so that it won't tear too much, hopefully. All right guys, I've got two pieces of the napkin cut out. I'm gonna go ahead and start um, with the Mod Podge. Oops. Great. So I'm just gonna put a thin layer of Mod Podge right on the bottom of the tray.
know what happened. I have that gap there, but um, I'm gonna try to fill it in. Okay guys, I've got the napkins on. Um, I'm gonna let them dry before I put the coat of Mod Podge on top. So I just wanna let them sit for a few minutes and then I'll come back and I'll put the um, another coat or a coat of Mod Podge on top. Put that on top and let it dry. But this is what it's looking like so far. Not too bad for my first decoupage project. Not too bad. But let's let this dry and I'll be back in a few minutes, guys. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and go over with the Mod Podge. Okay, guys, I've got that first layer of Mod Podge on, so I'm gonna let this layer dry and then I'll come back and put a second um, coat of Mod Podge and then that'll be it. Okay guys, now I'm gonna put the last coat of Mod Podge on the tray, let that dry, stay tuned, and I'll show you how I'm gonna decorate it. Okay guys, here is the finished product, my upcycled tray I'm using Mod Podge and napkins. I decoupage the tray, it was just a basic white tray but now I've upcycled it and turned it into this beautiful floral tray. And I think it'll make a nice addition in my kitchen. I've just added a yellow dish towel, this sweet little teapot, honey pot, and this vase of flowers. And so guys, I am loving the way that this looks. It is perfect for the spring season and taking me right into summer. Um, so for my first project, I'm pretty happy with the way that it turned out. Guys, let me know down in the comments if you like to use Mod Podge to decoupage. This was kind of fun for me, and um, like I said, it was my first time using um, Mod Podge, so won't be my last. I'll definitely be trying to uh, upcycle some more projects. But I want to thank Robin and Saving with Mrs. V for hosting this Upcycle Your Stash Challenge. V and Robin, thank you so much. I really enjoyed um, putting this project together. So thank you ladies so much for um, inviting us to participate. Uh, remember to go down into my description box. You'll find the playlist for this challenge and also the links to V and Robin's channels as well. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. If you enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment. I would love to hear from you. And thank you so much for all of your love and support of my channel. And guys, I will see you soon in the next video. Remember to always live your life to the fullest every day. Thanks for watching.